Obviously, I love him. He's my dad. Hmm. What does that hmm mean? Just say what you want to say. It's just, when you add obviously, it feels a little less obvious. So, I'll ask again. How do you really feel about your father? It's as if maybe it's a little more complicated than you feel comfortable admitting, which is completely understandable. Didn't really know him well. He wasn't around much. Well, you're gonna see him even less now, because he's dead. Just so sensitive. Listen, if I didn't love him, we wouldn't be here, right? We don't have to get into it. <laughs> nope, we're in it now. Why would I be trying to find the man who killed him if I didn't love him? Why would I be doing any of this? Ugh, sh**. My nose is bleeding. Thought I was getting emotionally snotty. No, it's probably from when I kicked you in the face. Yeah, thanks for reminding me. So, here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna hang you off the side of this building, and you're gonna tell me where Shroud is, or I'm going to drop you to your death. Come on, I thought we were having a breakthrough. Hey, we did. You know, for being a real piece of shit, you're pretty easy to talk to, but the only breakthrough I need right now is the location of Shroud. I'm not telling you shit, you loser! See, this is more like how I thought this would be. I hope Shroud kills you just like he killed your father. I hope he spanks your little daddy as you to death, you hear me? Uh, are we outside? Windy up here tonight, huh? Why are we outside? No telling where you live. It smells like outside smells. <clears throat> wait, hey, wait, wait! I have neighbors. Use your inside voice and just tell me where Shroud is. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, steel, steel mill, Llewellyn, uh, Llewellyn Steelworks, okay? You sure about that? Yes, please, that's all I know. Stop screaming. Help, help! Hey. Hey, hey, I will pull you up if you quiet the f*** now. Help! Sir, if you want something to scream about, I'll give you something to scream about. No, 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 no! <sighs> you piece of s***. Hey, I ruined a perfectly good mattress to make sure you didn't die, okay? You're welcome. Thank you. 
All right, next one. Get a copy of that video when we're through here. Cause it's over, Shroud. And it would be nice to watch that back at a different angle. Oh no, it's over, Shroud. All this build up face to face with your father's killer and you come in here with that lame shit. Ugh, where the f is Shroud? He'll be here in a bit. Oh hey, after our conversation, I asked him about your dad. Fun little tidbit, he was very well hydrated. Turns out right after Shroud shot him in the chest, your dad his pants. Bet you didn't know that, huh? So after that bullet tore through his insides, he still had enough time to know how absolutely he was and just himself like a little It was like so much Cause your dad was wearing shorts, so hey, just kept- I get it. It's a perfectly good mattress to break or fall. Perfectly good? Uh, I assume that stained thing was already in the dumpster. Can we just skip to the part where you reveal your bull superpower so we can fight for real? Huh? Cool. So you uh, got some kind of clever supervillain name? You can call me Toxic. Bro. That works on so many levels for you. Yeah, no th That's the point! <sighs> Trout augments are pretty good when normies like you use them. But when you put them on someone who already has powers... And chef's kiss. Figures. 